This video is about my experience with the strange phenomenon of bradykinesia and freezing of gait with Parkinson's. So here, over about the course of an hour, as my medication is starting to wear off, you get a sense of the, the deterioration that occurs over this time with uh, smaller steps, the balance becoming off, the rigidity in the left side especially. Also, I become more foggy cognitively. Meanwhile, my brain is making predictions still allowing me to walk it trusts me but I, I sense it is becoming more skeptical until finally you'll see a freeze up starts to occur where the brain says nope i'm going to shut you down and i have to use a lot of intention just to move at that point so after this deterioration is at some point you'll finally see the freeze occur and there it is that's when the brain the first freeze is the, when i try to get through the doorway the brain wants to shut my body down. But more than that, it's a physiological fear state that my body is in. It becomes very, very hard to escape it. It's almost like a survival mode. Walking with intention, I can overcome it somewhat. Walking, stepping over lines, I can overcome it mostly. And here I go through a series of pretty well-known ways of escaping a freeze, tossing a ball, um, kind of distracting me from the freeze. Crawling, I can crawl just fine. I can do almost anything but just a normal walk through the doorway. If I had a bike, I could ride a bike, but there I was just pretending to ride a bike. Backwards, I could more or less do through the doorway. And with a cane, it helps because uh, my brain feels, I guess it feels like it's safe. They're playing some ground ball, catching a ground ball, and using a walker adds a level of safety that the brain trusts. I can even go hands off the walker and do the kind of same thing ride the walker and then I bring out the big guns the music gets a rhythm going gets him changes the emotions and allows more movement than anything else except when I can First, change my state me, now anyway, and this particular night you believe you can. I was too deep into the freeze and too confined at home to really to get out of it it didn't work uh, as I've been able to do sometimes it mean you always will. these these are a couple examples of me getting out of a freeze the more you train it, um, at other times the more completely escaping to get it. in fact completely escaping Parkinson's for a temporary period feeling no symptoms whatsoever prove it to take it deeper I wish I could tell you how I get to full freedom of movement when only seconds earlier it felt impossible but I can't just experience it. Is that if a patient will find some way of going on and of preserving or recreating an identity uh, around the deficit, he will adapt. During the summer months, the patients came back to life. Their childish gaiety and enthusiasm shattered the hospital routine. It's as if, having lost all will of her own in which to act, she borrows the will of the ball. Give me three steps.